Um, and I wondered what would happen if the farmers went on strike. And I called this the farmers strike. It's the news across the nation from the coastal conurbation to the reaches where the creatures like the leeches and the pike spread the message to the eagles and the flapping ears of beagles. Yes, the farmers, rustic charmers, vermin harmers are on strike. For the supermarket giants screwed the prices of their clients. And the reason this was treason was the season, dried and fried, was on a cattle station where the strike had this, its foundation, where a baron known as Sharon thought that Karen's ferry ride would be far too good an ending for executives whose spending habits, painful and disdainful, were not gainful longer term. For while people loved the prices, they were blinded to the vices, secrets hidden and forbidden overridden by the firm. Sharon scrambled from the rubble of the price war that caused trouble, while the greedy suits with seedy skin and weedy legs took stock. When competitors are flattened, then the hatches will be battened and will trigger off the bigger plan. They'll snigger and they'll mock. Shattered shoppers who'll find dockets with their prices fired by rockets with weary wallets, bleary hearts and teary eyes. They're stewed. How much better to buy local? For our farmers are our focal point. No cropping means no shopping and a whopping lack of food. You think imports hold the answers? Are they quality enhancers? Will food purity, security, and surety be lost? Listen, Sharon has a vision, but we need a quick decision or strike action will gain traction. Our inaction has a cost. Sharon says, do we tomorrow and not nick yourself in sorrow? No excuses. Buy the juices and the mooses of our mates. Tell the mob at Coles and Woolies they're like scheming schoolyard bullies. Or the crickets in the thickets will have tickets to our plates. It's a question for the nation, from the coastal conurbation to the reaches where the creatures like the leeches all replete. Spread the message to the eagles and the flapping ears of beagles. From the boppers to the coppers, what will shoppers find to eat? Mm -hmm.